Notion is a unique tool because you can use it at work with your team and use it at home for your personal organization. With account switching, Notion gives you the separation you need for a healthy work-life balance while making sure they can access any of your content across any account on any device completely seamlessly. In this video, I'll show you how to use Notion workspaces to separate different types of content and how to quickly switch back and forth between workspaces. What you're seeing here on the screen is my personal workspace, which I named Second Brain. All these pages you see here in the sidebar live inside my Second Brain workspace. When you're brand new to Notion, it's best to keep it simple and start with just one workspace. For example, I have a second workspace that I use with my debate team. To switch workspaces, let's open this menu at the top left of the app and select the NYU Debate Team workspace. All these pages live in the Debate Team workspace, and the pages here in the workspace section of the sidebar are shared with all my teammates in this workspace. In the workspace switcher, you'll see that there are five people sharing the Debate Team workspace, but the Second Brain workspace is just me. They have different subscription levels too. I have a personal pro plan subscription for my Second Brain workspace and a team plan subscription for the Debate Team workspace. But what if I use Notion at work too? I have to use a different email address at work, but I don't really want to use my work email for my personal stuff. Luckily, Notion makes it easy to add another account. No need to log out of one account in order to log into another. Instead, click Add Another Account from Email and enter your login info. It doesn't matter if you use email and password or the Continue with Google and Continue with Apple buttons. We're in! Now that I added my work account, you'll see that the Acme Inc. workspace that I use at work was added to my workspace switcher, even though I use a different email for this workspace. Acme Inc. is listed under my work email, and my personal workspaces are listed under my personal email. In the three dot menus next to each account, you can add more workspaces or log out of individual accounts. As a friendly reminder, personal plan workspaces are always free and include unlimited storage. So if you mostly use Notion at work, you can always create another personal workspace for your eyes only and add as much content as you like, such as tasks, recipes, list of movies to watch, whatever you want. Plus, everything I just showed you works on our mobile apps too. Whether you're at home, at the office, or on the go, Notion is your one-stop shop. Separate workspaces allow for work-life balance, and easy account switching lets you jump back and forth as quickly and as often as you need.